Hello and welcome to Wigs with Liz. My name's Liz and I wear wigs and I'm really excited today because I've got another wig from Natural Image to share with you called Elusive and I've already done two other wig reviews on Elusive in two other colours but I finally got it in a blonde and I'm so excited. So I'm going to be sharing with you today Elusive wig from Natural Image in Platinum Mist Rooted. It's a really nice rooted platinum blonde. It's very pretty. And I'm super excited to get this on my head. Now, if you do like the wig I'm wearing right now, this is Freedom Wig in Raspberry Ice R from Godiva Secret Wigs. And I did a little video on this yesterday and shared it because, you know, I just love this wig so much. And when it's styled right, when I've got it how I want it, this wig is just the bee's knees. And, you know, that's what I'm wearing today. And I don't want to take it off my head, but I know I have to to do this wig review. So if you like the wig I'm wearing right now, if you like the colour, the style, the way it is, you can check out my review on this wig in the wig review playlist. This is Freedom from Godiva Secret Wigs. But the wig I'm going to show you right now is called Elusive. It's by Natural Image and it's in Platinum Mist Rooted. Now, I have already reviewed this wig in a gorgeous chocolate copper colour and a gorgeous, absolutely stunning um, red, you know, really pretty red colour. But this is a blonde, so I'm really excited. So I haven't sewn wig clips into this yet either. It's brand new. I've took the bits out. I've, I've taken off the label and... You know, took it out and tried it on, but I haven't done anything else with it. So it's a very short, gorgeous, curly bob. Love it. So look at this. Look at this. Amazing. Now, look at the curl for one in this gorgeous colour. It really is a platinum blonde. It's something special, this one is. I'm really looking forward to putting wig clips into this and wearing it out and about. And I love with the rooted wigs how they go all the way through the wig. You know, so you don't just get the root on the party. You get it all through the wig. So it's very natural. So if the wind blows, it still looks like your own hair. It still creates the illusion, you know, that this is your hair, especially if you've got dark hair. Maybe you're a blonde and you want a rooted blonde for a change. But it's a very, very pretty wig. And I love how, you know, the bangs on this wig as well, you know, the longer. So... You can either cut a bang in if you want to, or you can just push them to the side and just wear it as a very pretty wig. So let's get it on then. Let me show you inside first of all. So the cap is very light, breathable. It's a very light wig, as you can see. You know, I can hold it with my finger. It's got lots of breathable wefting at the back, so it's really nice and comfortable to wear, very airy and light. And then at the front, you've got breathable um, wefting at the front as well it has got that machine teasing to give it the height and the thing I love about these wigs is you know where the hairline is because obviously it's not a lace front wig but where the hairline is the bit that goes on your you know your head so soft you know this is so soft it just feels really nice to wear so it's lovely feeling this wig really really nice and he's got the label at the back so you know how to put it on where the back is and where the front is and he's got velcro adjusters you know, so you can adjust them to make the wig tighter or looser to suit your own hat. So let's get her on then. So when this wig comes, you know, it does come with this kind of natural parting. You know, you can break this up a little bit if you want to. You know, I've got my um, trusty brush. So just give it a little brush through the parting just to break the fibres up a little bit. It's a curly wig. I don't want to put a brush through it at all. You know, if I'm going to do that, I'll just use my fingers may put a little bit of water on or something like that but all I'm doing is just breaking up you know the parting a little bit so I can part it how I want it to be that's all I'm doing and I haven't done that yet I've literally got it out tried it on thought I love that one and put it away so you know it's with great reluctance I'm going to take freedom off so let me take freedom off and this is my hair which is growing as you can see it's getting longer now getting long now and you know I have got it all back so you can't actually tell right now just how long it is but trust me it is I've even got a little pony going on at the back because you know I've got this little flyaway piece and I don't want to cut that off because you know it's actually helping my wigs to go on much better so I'm just putting that in a tiny little ponytail at the back just to secure the wig and I'm just pushing all of my own natural hair out of the way so let's put a on that 
So I'm going to put my thumbs at the back of the wig where the label is and I'm going to put the front of the wig about there and I'm going to pull my head into it. Now on these wigs, they've got two adjusters at the side. I'm going to level them up, they're very comfortable and then I'm going to pull the wig up to my natural hairline and she's good to go. So remember at the moment I haven't sewn wig clips in but I will sew two in soon there and there. So let's put her on. Very quick experience putting a wig on. Just going to get my natural hair out of the way going to flick it up and you can see it's got this kind of natural side parting so even though it isn't a lace front wig it still looks very very natural on me and then on anyone but on me as well because I'm a natural brunette so I just wanted to show you without before I lift it up how natural it looks okay obviously not like this I look like a werewolf so I'm going to raise it up to my natural hairline so it's about there okay get it about right there and good to go now the thing i love about these natural image wigs is you don't have to do much to them at all to wear them you know so it's not like you have to style them loads so they go into style it just comes ready to wear and you know if you love curl like i do you're gonna absolutely love this wig and you know i love this in the rich chestnut color i've got it in which is a gorgeous red and the the chocolate copper colour, which is a really nice, deep, rich brown. But I'm loving this platinum wand. It's very pretty. And the reason I chose this colour is because, you know, on the, the demo video, when you go on, well, not on the demo video, but when you go on the website to buy this wig, this is the wig, this colour is what she is wearing in the picture. And it just looks stunning. So I really do like this colour and, you know, I love the curl. It's a real natural wavy curl, very pretty and elegant. You know, you can easily try and style it somewhere else. But for me, I just like that letting the wig do what it's naturally doing. And you can see because I've broke up that parting a little bit, it looks very natural on. And it gives it a little bit of height. Obviously, you've got the body anyway because it's machine teased. It's got that volume, you know, and I like the fact that you just can you know, move it out of the way. You know, with this wig as well, what I like to do occasionally is grab a little bit of the hair and just pop it behind my ear and it keeps the fringe out of the face. You know, and that looks very, very pretty and natural too. But I do love on these wigs how they just naturally stay out of the face. You know, it does remind me a lot, this wig of Zara from Godiva's Secret Wigs, but obviously a cheaper version of it. And, you know, that, that wig is obviously, you know, it's monofilament, so it, it, it's a lot more natural. But I love this wig. You know, I'm very into these natural image wigs. For the money, I think they're absolute bargain. You know, this one um, was, a, I think it was £119 to buy. And I got it from Natural Image Wigs website. And I've done a review on them as well. They're really good. Okay, the service, the customer service isn't too good, but you get your wig within days. And this one was actually on back order and I ordered it and then it came out about two weeks after. I actually forgot I'd ordered it and then the wig turned up and I was like, oh yeah, I ordered that wig. So don't be afraid if you're ordering for them to, you know, if something's out of stock to put it on back order because it will come. It will come. And I really do want this one as well in caramel glow because I've got that in Josephine and it's a very, very pretty colour. So I'm going to show you with the mirror first of all. Look at this. Very, very pretty little bob. Very pretty. Very natural looking, I think, even though it's a platinum blonde. You know, you might think blonde looks a bit odd on me, but I really do like this. I'm excited to wear this out and about. Look at the gorgeous parting as well. So I'll just show you with my head down. You know, you can see the rooting there, which again, like I say, goes all through the wig. So even though this is my natural hair here, it still looks very natural because of the rooting, which is so clever. And this is the wig from the side. And this is the wig from the back. You know, I just love all this natural curl and the way it is, the style of it. It's very pretty. So it is a little bit shorter at the back and it's a bit longer at the front, but it goes completely well. You know, it's not like um, when I reviewed some of the fever wig collection wigs that I get from Amazon, you know, the Smithies ones where they're a bit lopsided. This one is just perfectly natural and I just love it. You know, I just love it. So you can put a little clip in there. You could clip it out of the way and bring it forward. There's many things you can do with this. It reminds me a bit of Marilyn Monroe, you know, a bit of a Marilyn Monroe vibe with this wig. It's very, very pretty. You can even imagine 
you know, putting a little bit up there, clipping it up maybe here. You know, obviously you couldn't put this in a ponytail because it's too short, but you could do other things with it. It's very, very pretty. You could put a headband in with this, but I just kind of like wearing them the way they are. And the thing I really like about this one is the, this colour, the way it's come, it's just really holding the style nicely. Whereas with the chocolate copper mist one, um, the, it's like a, a dark chocolate. You can check that out in the wig reviews. That one does come a little tiny bit more in the face. And, you know, it is the fibres they're made with and things like that. Every wig as well, you know, you can get, get the same wig in the same colour and it may look different. Because obviously every wig is an individual as well, you know. But I just really like that. So I'm really liking that on it right now. I just really like it. I think it's a very pretty wig. And I love the colour. You know, it's just this gorgeous kind of silvery blonde. So it is blonde, but it looks silver to me. You know, it's got a hint of silver, which is really nice. Because, you know, I haven't got a silver wig. A high-end silver wig anyway. I want to get one. But I really do like that look as well. And it's just very, very pretty on me. I like it anyway. So I'm liking this wig and I'm excited to wear it out and about. So let me know what you think. You know, let me know what you think of this gorgeous wig. This is a loose sieve from Natural Image in Platinum Mist Rooted. So yeah, really, really pretty. And you know, if you want to see me in other colours in this wig, I want to get Audacious as well, which is a bit like... Uh, my other go-to natural image wig, I like Josephine as well and Glow Getch, I do like them all. But if I want a wig where I'm just going out, you know, I'm going down the shops or I'm, I'm just nipping out somewhere, throwing on a Lucy, throwing on Audacious, perfect wigs, a bit like Freedom, you know, throwing on Freedom, you just feel really good. So a Lucy from Natural Image Wigs in Platinum Mist Rooted, beautiful. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.